What's going on, y'all? It's your girl, Dale Denise, back again with another video. In today's video, I did another pickup. I purchased some Mugler jeans. And uh, from my experience, let's just say I decided to make a video because, ladies, the sizing of this jean is different. So, if you're interested in watching this, if you're interested in purchasing, if you're thinking about purchasing Mugler jeans, I advise you, highly suggest you watch this video before purchasing. Let's get into it. Y'all, if you haven't already, before we even get started, hit that subscribe button down below. Hit that notification bell so you know when I post. Don't forget to like this video and comment as well, okay? Let's get right into it. So I purchased my pair of Mugler jeans from Farfetch. It just came in this box. I thought I'd save the box. I had to try them on prior to the video, but yeah, so it just came in this regular box. I just opened it up, okay? And then the jeans came, right? Funny story, the tags are not on them right now, but I'll insert clips of me when I literally first opened them. I was supposed to go out one night and wear them, and then I ended up not going out. This is fresh out. I didn't even do the review yet, but I wanted to add this piece in because I'm about to actually wear them. I'm, I'm, okay, I'm feeding the weight. I'm going to get them from Farfetch. So they came with two tags and then a Farfetch tag. This is how it looks. I've been freshly taking it out to the box. Freshly taking it out. Here goes the size right here, 40. Oh, yeah. Back to the so I did opt to get the denim one. I didn't get the one with the sheer panels or the one with the black. So it was like two-tone denim. So they look like this. And then, you know, the front is just the lighter color, right? And that pattern goes all the way through. It like wraps around. Of course, I'll do a try on portion like I always do. Now, like I always say, I'm gonna tell you my sizes. I'm typically 130 pounds, like size three and five in US. Based off of Farfetch's website, they told me to actually go ahead and purchase a 38. I believe the model was wearing a 34 and she looked really slim, so I knew that that wasn't gonna fit me. I'll insert one of these sides, the reference chart. According to Farfetch's website, the Mugler jeans, they start from a 32. The 32 is set to be a US zero and an extra, extra, extra small. A 34 is an extra, extra small. The 36 is an extra small. 38 is a small, a 40 is a medium. So I'm typically a size three, five, or I'm like a size four US other type of us of four so i'm like a three or five or a size four or we could just say th between a three to five and i'm like a size small i'm typically not a medium so originally i did purchase these jeans in a 38 based off the website and everything i was like right, i'm gonna purchase the 38 the 38 came and i couldn't get them up past my thighs the crotch like this was my crotch and this was the crotch of the jeans i couldn't get the crotch up because my thighs wouldn't let me pull them up and then it pancaked my butt in. So I was so upset. I had to do the whole return process, whatever. It was honestly though, Farfetch's return process is great. The only thing is though, I fiend out and I didn't wait for the, the return to be processed before ordering a new pair because when I looked online, the next size I thought I would need was the 40. It was only like one size left. So I jumped on it. I was like, I'll just get the refund. And the refund process literally took like about a week or so. So, I mean, I could have waited two weeks, but I just didn't want to chance it because I really wanted this jeep. So I went ahead and I purchased a 40. These are a 40. Ladies, I'm letting you know right now. If you're on the slim side, get your regular size because these jeans are made more for like really slim and slender females. So if you're slim and slender, get your regular size. If you have any type of butt, hip, thigh, if you're if you're more like on the slim thick to go into the thick side, I would suggest you go up at least one or two sizes. Yes, one or two sizes. Please learn from me. If you're more on a slim and slender size, get your regular size. You should be fine because these are made more for like slender women. But if you're 
more on the thick or go on the thicker side, I would suggest you going up at least one or two sizes in these. Learn from me. So I did get a 40 in these. And again, I'm 130 pounds. I'm five foot two, usually a size three or five or four. And I'm like a size small, all right? So I am gonna try them on, like I stated, but I do love these jeans. They're very high-waisted too. So me, I'm only 5'2". They literally come up past my belly button, almost to like my, the top of my waist. And I'll show you again in the try-on portion. They're very high-waisted. The back, the design, I feel like even if you do not have much butt, this gives you the illusion that you got the cake. All right, it does. Cause the design that it does with the whole, this and, and these stitching it really accentuates your butt and it makes it pop out more than you know it gives an illusion so even if you don't got the little booty you don't got the little cakes you gonna have them in these jeans trust me and then i love how it just wraps around like it comes then you see that darker denim comes in there i'm not gonna lie i think i might try to get the sheer ones but not the sheer ones with the butt just the sheer ones that's in the leg and i think i i don't want them to be because these are like the skinny considered the skinny jeans i think i want my next pair to be the boot cut so i think i'm gonna order one more pair and when i do of course i'll come back and do a review but i did get them on farfetch i'll link them down below in the description i did get the new season ones and yeah these are them i love them i can't wait to style them i do think that these are worth the money the quality is very good it doesn't have much stretch that's something else with these jeans Again, hence why I couldn't get them up. So they don't really have much stretch. The darker part does have a little bit of stretch. This lighter part doesn't, which it makes sense as to why I couldn't really get them up on the leg in the front, because most of it is that, because um, it wraps around me. So most of it is the lighter part. But it, it even, it just, it just, the, the 40 fit me perfectly, and I'll show you. But I think that if you're on the verge of getting them, go get them. You deserve it. Spin your coins. Treat yourself. You want the Moogler jeans? Go ahead and get the Moogler jeans. You deserve it, sis. You deserve it. I like this too. The print is very nice. I like that it's in blue. My favorite color is blue. And I feel like this color denim will go a lot with a lot of stuff. But yeah, I'm excited. So we're going to go ahead into the try on portion, all right? Let's get into that. Very high. Very high waisted. Very nice. And again, this is a 40. This is a 40 that I'm wearing. Okay. Only thing that I would say though, I do have a little bit of room right here. Let's see if I can pull them up more. But as you can see, I have no more room in my thigh. So if I would have went down the size, it wasn't coming up, which is what happened. Alright. So this is it, y'all. This is it. I really like these jeans. I cannot wait to wear them. And also, one more thing. These are really tall girl friendly. Look, I'm 5'2", and they're all the way past my foot. I'll zoom down so you can see. So they're definitely tall girl friendly. A lot of room in them. All right, y'all. So I hope you enjoyed this video more of the story if you're more on a slim slender size you should be fine with getting your regular size if you're you're more on a curvier side you got little hips and curves and stuff definitely size up to one or two sizes and you should be fine if you haven't already and you came this far i hope you already subscribed to my channel i hope we vibing i hope you're part of the team you're part of the crew we here and as always until next time bye beauties see y'all next time Mwah!